yeah today exactly i'm just uh, you know more interested like uh, you know i already done those things uh, as i from like you know part 1 part 2 so now basically this is part uh, 3 and from like you know part 1 like you know extracting prices and then second like you know uh, downloading csv files then charting and now this third part mainly basically uh, you know as we all love this uh, candlestick charts okay so uh, i am you know trying to create a chart with the help of this adjacent close and volume i am taking here these two things okay and 10 days uh, basically i am taking this in a volume of 10 days so and adjacent close in 10 days so uh, i am you know uh, basically we as a you know for uh, chart study we basically love this candlestick and probably uh, i also most love uh, this candlestick charts so i am here to create the candlestick charts basically with the help of those uh, uh, you know csv uh, files or say datas or you know uh, for data manipulation uh, i wanna see those charts with the help of candlestick charts i want to study so basically i'm creating here candlestick chart so what i can do is like uh, previous video like part one part two will be there so uh, you can refer those things from that one here exactly i just show you what are the changes will be there so here i'm just uh, you know i uh, want candlestick so what i'm doing is uh, i'm doing is from matplotlib dot finance import mat import candlestick underscore ohlc so as i can see if i try to this candlestick uh, you know with the python say this is like 3.6 and i'm trying to do here but i definitely get some warnings but not a problem since i'm able to get candlesticks that is good for me okay so next uh, the changes will be like import map plot lib dot dates as the updates uh, okay uh, i think for dates as i can see okay and everything has the uh, same okay so here we nsc dot csv as you can see the uh, you know nifty data i just um, you know downloaded in a csv file and now actually i'm trying to read so basically in this csv file i just want adjacent close and volume so i said i just say uh, df uh, ohlc now, now this is ohlc means open high low close so okay so i'm just taking with this adjacent close volume please uh, do follow this uh, quotes uh, means uh, as it is okay uh, so you can basically can get those uh, whatever you want candlestick okay so better to follow and you don't miss anything last time i just uh, you know uh, got case sensitive here i just uh, you know uh, got with uh, small one so basically i am getting more uh, error here so just to avoid basically follow this uh, codes okay you can go with the code and ax1 uh, pld dot sub plot to grid uh, you know you can for this like uh, column uh, row and column span you can go with this and this you can share with this uh, you know below bottom uh, charts will be there which you can share this one and axis date and then i want this candlestick uh, you know open high low close and volume i'll say and uh, color up say for like a green it will be like if it goes up so i just say green so g for green so you can use this and i will just go plt dot show okay so please do follow up this course uh, very much uh, i have actually already done so i just show you how you can easily can do i just get warning message but not a problem for me as i get my this one so basically if i just uh, what i am like you know uh, this is a main so while importing it's like candlestick underscore open high low close okay so this is important and dates is very much important so if you want to like really draw candlestick charts so basically this is uh, you know code as you can go for this and please do code if you have got any error please do comment so i just uh, save this and i will run okay so let's just check me what i get so basically i got warning here but not a problem says i got the candlestick charts okay so as you can see i just uh, you know basically go with and with the help of as you can see this is the nifty charts so as i can see this is a beautiful candlestick charts and you as you can go you know by zooming stuff you can study wherever like you know you want to plot you want to actually check and you if you want to 
go with you know by side and wanna look where it is like you know gone for these days and where exactly you know you can go and back if you will go you can exactly can get those you know previously what you have done with the charts you can get okay so that's it here like you know data as you can see 2014 has been made so much impact 2010 has been this so up to like you know days have been taken and so from this point of movement it has been done this work and this point of movement it has been done so you can go through this and can enjoy your candlestick charts okay so i'll just wind it up here thank you thank you for watching guys and if you do have any like difficulties or you get any like error or do you have any kind of uh, uh, problems uh, I can resolve please do comment and uh, please do uh, 